Hi Aquarius, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I'm here to do your reading now. And it's actually better that you guys are at the end for a few reasons. Um, first of all, my little cross here. This is a, like a blessing. And um, what, it, what it is, is I've had this on my other deck and this has just been like tagged to this other deck for a good month. Okay, just like this. It's been tagged to this deck like this. With a with a cord, you know, a thingy, and uh, <laughs> I used the deck for a couple of private readings, and the readings were like, wow, 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 wow. So I decided I was going to put it on this deck. And who's up next? It's been sitting on this deck. You guys are up next. So let's see if you guys get a blessed reading. And patience, patience, patience. I was doing the dishes earlier today, you know, thinking about I have to do Aquarius and Pisces. I have to do Aquarius and Pisces. This is a spirit reading, okay? I have to do Aquarius and Pisces. I got to do it. And I was thinking, and then I was just doing the dishes. Patience kept coming. Patience, patience. Somebody needs some patience. I don't know who it is. Somebody that is watching this needs to have patience, okay? divine timing perhaps oh we're gonna get you one of these first spirit message for Aquarius Contemplation. I just wrote this in my group. I seriously just barely got done writing this in my group. It's, that's weird. Oh, I wrote a quiet day of contemplation. I just wrote it maybe five minutes ago. That's nuts. I was, I was getting ready to do your, I sat down over here to do your reading. And I decided to go on Facebook first. And I wrote a quiet day of contemplation. And the card contemplation comes up. Interesting. Wow. Gaining overview, detached observation, increased understanding, solitude, integration through reflection. They were talking to me before when I was on Facebook. <laughs> That's what was happening. I came over here to do your reading, brought my computer and got ready. Decided to go on Facebook first. And they were like, no, 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 no. This is for Aquarius and it's about contemplation. <laughs> Interesting, interesting. Detached observation. Solitude, integration through reflection. Suffering in silence. Many of you have been going through some sort of mental anguish. But it's bringing you a transformation. It's bringing you a new beginning. So you're not suffering in vain, okay? Yes, the mental conflict is here. But, you know, it's time to stop procrastinating and go down the new road. I see that you've been through so, some sort of dilemma. But it appears that it's over because that's a death card. The 13 is a death card. With that card, there is a new beginning in front of you, okay? I, it appear, maybe you guys have been ignoring the truth of a situation and just suffering. You know, the truth is there. The truth is within you. And you've been keeping it to yourself, perhaps. That's the solitude, the contemplation. And now the universe or the world card is here to say you've learned something through this time of suffering. You've learned something really big. When the world card comes out, it means that there's a big lesson that has been learned through this suffering. And you definitely have a new beginning right in front of you with these two cards. A transformation. Okay, that card is accurate. You guys are going to be going through a major transformation within the next 13 months. Okay? 
you know, it's been, you probably were feeling a lot of discontent, a lot of, maybe you were feeling unloved or like you couldn't offer love because of these conflicts, because of these, this suffering, but it was, you were learning through this process. You were growing this contemplation that you've been going through has really served you very well. Okay, because it's really taught you this lesson. When the universe comes up, a lesson has been learned. And maybe it has something to do with divine timing or patience because that came up as well. Look at the conflicts. Oh my gosh. You guys have seriously been through some um, mental dilemmas, okay? You really, really have. But now the time has come where... It's time to release. It's time to release those mental conflicts. It's time to let them go, okay? Because it's it's time for you to receive what you do, okay? It's time. It, it's really time for you guys to... have the growth that you have invested so much of your energy on. You know what I mean? I see that you've invested a lot of energy, a lot of thinking, a lot of thought, a lot of suffering, a lot of uh, mental uh, anguish on something. And now it's time to release that, sever those ties, and invest in the future. Okay, but anyway, I want to zoom this in before I go any further. There we go. <laughs> Your hard work wasn't in vain, okay? This suffering that you've been going through is not in vain. Now is the time for you to reap, to you to reap some, reap some rewards of all this anguish that you've been through, okay? It appears that... You know, you may have not been seeing any positive. You might have, might have been only feeling a whole lot of negative and the positive just wasn't even being seen. But in the background, things were transpiring that you couldn't see. And that's, that's what it is, okay? Things were transpiring and they were manifesting whether you saw it growing or not. Because I really feel that you the seeds were planted a really a long long time ago for this transformation and now's the time for you to go down this new road i see that many of you are starting a new chapter of your life after a period of suffering and not being able to speak up for yourselves okay that's what i see it's like now the suffering is about to end and you're about to go down a beautiful new path and it appears that you have the skills to succeed. You needed these skills. You needed this suffering to learn something. And I know that sucks. It's not what you want to hear. But you've been through something big. You've learned a big, huge lesson. And now it's time for you to celebrate this as a success. Okay? It's time for this that, that chapter of your life to end. And it's time to step on the new path. Okay, it is the right time. Divine timing absolutely does come into play here. The time is now. The time is now for you to use the skills that you have learned with this past experience to step on to this new journey with faith. Okay, many of you are going through a transformation that is life changing. It allows you to release all these mental conflicts and start anew. So Aquarius, your spirit message is, all this suffering was not in vain. Congratulations, you have learned a huge lesson. And now it's time for you to start a brand new transformation journey. Okay? You're going down a new path. Brand new. <laughs> 